Hi, this is J2 here. On this video, I'll be showing you how to determine the bit, wish, or borrow using the subnet mask. So, this right here, it is the previous subnetting and IP chart, which I used on my previous video. Figure out the IPv4 address and the subnet mask. And if you want to take a look at the previous video, I'll leave a link below for you to actually click on and you could actually go back and look at how I set this chart up. Okay, so I'm going to be using IP address 192.168.1.2 and the subnet mask to be 255.255.255.240. Okay, and the only thing I'm looking at is actually just the subnet mask. It's actually that right there and that right there. I'm going to be using that to determine the bits which are being borrowed. So I'm going to be looking at the first octet and the first octet it is 255. So right here I got 255 right here. So I'm just going to fill this out. 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, all the way to 255. So I got 8 of these right here. So that would be 8 bits plus another 255. So that's 8 of those again. So that would be 8 bits. And same with this right here. That would be 8 bits. And then the next one is actually 240. So 240 is actually right there. So I'm just going to fill up 111 until all the way to 240. And then the rest is going to be 0000. And because I only got 41, that's going to be 4 bits. So plus 4 bits. And that will equal 28 bits. So I will write this as 192.168.1.2 for slash 28. And again, thanks for watching and hopefully this little review will help you determine how to borrow bits for using the subnet mask.